National Geographic Kids presents Sea Turtles, written by Laura Marsh. A sea turtle. What hatches on land but spends its life in the sea? What starts out the size of a ping pong ball but can grow up to seven feet long? A sea turtle. Ocean World, the leatherback sea turtle. Sea turtles are graceful swimmers in the water. Their flippers move like wings. Sea turtles travel the world in warm ocean waters. They are one of the few reptiles that live in the sea. The dark blue area shows where sea turtles travel. A reptile is a cold-blooded animal that lays eggs and has a backbone and scaly skin. A sleek body helps the turtle move easily through the water. The scales on its shell are called chutes. And a sea turtle has lungs because it breathes air. A sea turtle holds its breath underwater. Sea turtles can't pull their heads and limbs into their shells like land turtles can. Their large, powerful flippers act like paddles. Scientists believe some sea turtles live 80 years or more, but they don't know for sure. The back flippers steer the turtle as it swims. They are also used um, to dig nests in the sand. This is a green sea turtle. Meet the turtles. The loggerhead is the most common sea turtle in the southeastern United States. It gets its name from its large head. There are seven kinds of sea turtles in the world. Each has special features. The flat back has a flat body. It's the only sea turtle that doesn't live in the U.S. waters. It lives near Australia. The olive ridley has an olive colored shell. It's shaped like a heart. The hawksbill can't dive deep. It spends most of its time on the water surface. The Kemp's ridley likes shallow waters. It's the world's most endangered sea turtle. The green turtle has a small head. Unlike other sea turtles, it goes ashore to warm itself in the sun. The leatherback doesn't have a hard shell. It's rubbery with small bones underneath. Nest building. A female sea turtle comes on land to lay her eggs. These are the female olive ridley sea turtles. She usually returns to the same beach where she hatched. Scientists aren't sure how sea turtles know where to go. They think sea turtles know by instinct. The sea turtle digs a hole with her back flippers. She lays her eggs and covers them with sand. She returns to the sea. Instinct is a behavior that animals are born knowing how to do. This is the female green sea turtle digging a nest. Oh baby, crack! The eggs hatch after 50 to 70 days. Tiny turtles called hatchlings crawl out of their eggshells. A hatchling is a young animal that has just come out of an egg. They are less than three inches long. The baby loggerhead sea turtle is hatching from its shell in this picture. Hatchlings usually crawl toward the sea at night. In, in the dark, they are hidden from predators. The little turtles follow the brightest light. The line where the sky meets the sea is the brightest natural light on a beach. If the hatchlings follow this beach, then they will make it to the sea. Big and small. The smallest sea turtles are the Kemp's Ridley and Olive Ridley. Adults are about two feet long and weigh up to 100 pounds. The largest sea turtle is the leatherback. It can grow up to more than seven feet long and weigh more than 2,000 pounds. That's about 10 men put together. Whoa. On the menu, munch, munch, once for lunch. Most sea turtles eat plants and animals. They dine on algae, a simple non-flowering plant that does not have stems, roots, or leaves and other sea grasses. They also munch on crabs and conch. Jellyfish are a favorite food for many sea turtles, but plastic trash can look like jellyfish in the ocean, and that spells trouble. Swallowing trash can hurt and even kill sea turtles. Danger, uh-oh, this is a hawk sea hawksbill sea turtle caught in a net. Trash isn't the only danger to sea turtles, 
Fishing nets and hungry animals can harm them too. Building lights can confuse hatchlings so they don't reach the sea. Sometimes people even step on sea turtle nests by accident. Sea turtle rescue. In 2010, a giant oil spill leaked into the Gulf of Mexico. Oil covered sea animals and washed up on beaches. Oil is very dangerous to people and wildlife. Here's the oil on the beaches in Louisiana. And here's an oil covered Kemp's Ridley sea turtle. People in charge of a sea turtle rescue program in Louisiana saved many sea turtles. The rescuers cleaned the turtles and gave them medicine. People cared for them until they could return to the sea. Safe keeping. You don't need to work at a sea turtle hospital to help sea turtles. Here are a few things you can do to keep them safe. Number one, pick up trash on the beach. Number two, don't release balloons into the air. They often end up in the sea. Number three, turn out lights that could be seen from the beach. Number four, read beach warning signs and avoid turtle nesting areas. Number five, tell your classmates what you've learned about sea turtles. The end. Thanks for watching.